Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Prisma. Today we are going to compare our Prisma and the Mongoose. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. Prisma and the Mongoose are both database tools, <coughs> but they are designed for the different use cases and the work with different types of databases. Here's a comparison between the Prisma, <coughs> which is typically works with the SQL databases and the Mongoose, which is designed for the MongoDB or no SQL databases. Prisma database support Prisma is commonly used with the SQL databases as such as PostgreSQL, MemoSQL, SQLite, SQL Server. It generates a type safety query builder based on the database schema. Type safety <coughs> Prisma emphasis on the type safety generating the TypeScript for the JavaScript code based on your database schema. It helps to reduce runtime errors by ensuring the type corrections and in your queries. Automatic query generations. Prisma generates a query builder automatically based on your data model, simplifying database interactions. Migrations. Prisma has inbuilt support for the database migrations, making it easier to manage changes in your database schema. Modern development. Prisma embraces modern development practices such as code generation and has modern intuitive API. Then we have a mongoose. <coughs> Database support. Mongoose is specifically designed for the MongoDB or NoSQL databases. It provides a schema based approach for modeling data in the MongoDB. Flexibility. MongoDB is schema less by nature. A Mongoose provides flexibility in defining the data structures, making it suitable for the dynamic and evolving schemas. Middleware Mongoose supports middleware functions that allows you to execute logic before and after certain events, pop population, Mongoose supports population, which allows to reference documents from other collections and populate them when needed. Validation, so by default, Mongoose defines the validations, allowing you to enforce data integrating rules. So choose Prisma if you are working with a SQL databases. Prisma is also come with the MongoDB also. So we can integrate, we can use the MongoDB database with Prisma, right? <clears throat> nothing like we can't we cannot use the prisma model over here but the queries structure the query the way of writing the queries is going to be changed in the prisma right and the prioritize the type safety automatically automatic query generation modern development practices choose mongo if you are working with a mongodb but if you are working with the mongodb you can also choose with the prisma also you can also use the queries of the prisma to integrate with the mongodb for a prefer flexible schema ultimately the choice between the prisma and the mongoose depends on your database schema sql versus no sql but it also mongodb also can be used in the prisma so i'm going to teach you like uh, how we can work with the prisma with the mongodb how we can work with the sql mysql then we have a postgresql so through these three databases we are going to work in the coming series right so don't forget to like share and comment on my video Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.